When I had a lust for power, I knew this. But so strong as to commit such a crime. What about Svanriga? What's his fate? He'll lose his home, his name, his honor. He'll choose exile. Or death. But enough. Whatever comes, we must endure. I thank you, Geralt. Again? No need. Again. I'll not take any more of this modesty. This is a land of heroes. Let this remind you of that. And now, I must ride for Gedinath, for the Jarl's council. Time to pick a king. What do you think? Who'll get the nod? Come with me. See for yourself. All may listen to our deliberations. I do have a horse in the race. Can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. Just in time. They've already started. Some would see another in my place. I thank those who stood at my side. Here, beneath the sacred oak, I pledge to be a good queen to the ones and the others. I want peace and prosperity to reign in Skellige. And I count on you to help me fulfill that dream. Ceres! 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 Take up arms for her. Congratulations. You'll make a great queen. Thank you. Wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. What's the new queen of Skellica planning? Um, to listen, learn, and listen again. Then we'll see. Good plan. I must unite the clans. I'd rather avoid war, but if Nilfgaard aims to attack, we must repel them together. Drummond folk might be a problem. I saw Lugas during the ceremony. Furious, to say the least. There's always been strife between our clans. But I must try and talk to him. Just might bring him around. Got a delicate matter I wanted to bring up. Need your help. What is it? Crox mentioned Siri to you? He must have. Have you found her? Not yet, but I'm close. Problem is, as soon as I get to her, the Wild Hunt will probably be able to locate us quickly. So I'll want to take her to Kaer Morin, battle the hunt there. I'm looking for allies. I can't leave the lands now. It's impossible. What I can do is give you my best warrior, Yalmar. Think you'll be willing? I'm sure of it. 
In fact, I think I'd be overjoyed. Come on, you know him. Yeah, I guess I do. Thanks. No doubt he'd be valiant. I hope he proves useful too. Good luck. You all right? So so. Any way you cut it, I was bested by a wedge. Not just any wedge. Aye, true. Suppose if it had to be so, glad it was Ceres. Not even a little proud of her? Come on, admit it. A bit, aye. She's the blood of me blood, bone of me bone. But don't tell her I said so. Liable to puff out her chest. Which would do her good now I think of it. <laughs> we showed Lugos. That's most important. Did you see that rage grip him? I thought it burst. Yeah, surprised to see him in that much of a half, actually. Our clans have been putting heads, chests, bellies forever. It's the lay of the land. The Wild Hunt's preparing to attack Kaer Morhen. Could use your help. Raids at the gate of your Witcher stronghold. You're a friend of the clan. I cannot refuse you. What's more, no one crates ever stood in battle such a foe. I'll leave at once. Thanks. Won't forget this. Telling you, Geralt, since you and Yalmer defeated the Ice Giant together, I see you as one of our own. I got the look of a Skelliger. You've got the heart of an Uncrate. Your daughter. First woman to rule Skellige. She'll be a good queen. Knows what she wants. Yeah? So what does she want? To unite all of Skellige's clans. A difficult task. No one has ever managed it. But Ceres is stubborn. Thinking long term, then. Think she'll succeed? She's got a powerful ally. In me. This isn't easy, but I need to ask you a favor. A big one. Tell me, friend. Siri. I know where she is. But I also know that as soon as I reach her, the Wild Hunt will know I did. They'll come after us, attack, and we'll need to respond with strength. Can I count on you? Black ones first. Now wraiths. Such is life. Bring her here. But we'll face them in battle. What's this about the Nilf Guardians? Of late, look seaward and you'll see their son on a sail, staring right back. We've yet to capture any of their crew, and only a fool would know they're planning something. But fear not, we'll banish the Black Ones and the White Hunt. Two birds with one skeleton axe. Then he will be safe with Kertru. Can't risk your men's lives. Kermorhen, we fight them there, nowhere else. Kermorhen is hundreds of miles away. To move an army there would take weeks. Not to mention, I'd expose the Isles to Nilfgaard's blows. Geralt, forgive me, but I cannot do it. I understand. Won't take up any more of your time. Farewell. Wait! let you leave empty-handed. I'll help as I can. Come with me. Beautiful craftsmanship. Got a talented smith. Not I. King Erlen got great did. Erlen Stonefist. So this is Winter's Blade. Thought I was a legend. Forged in Mahakam, tempered in dragon fire. Been in the Uncrate family for centuries. And now, it's yours. Thank you. This can't be easy for you. I appreciate it all the more.
May it serve you well. Send my specters back where they came from. That's my intention. Farewell. Talk. The Wild Hunt will attack Care Morin soon. Gonna need your help. The Wild Hunt? Are you certain? So, uh, you found Siri? I know where she is. And the Wild Hunt will also learn that as soon as I find her. I see. I shall pack immediately. Leave tomorrow at the latest. Thank you. Girl, and I still a duty to her. I shall see you at Care Mohan. The curse that held Uma proved hard to lift, but Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf, and an elven sage at that. Avalach, for this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt, then hidden her away on the Isle of Mists. The 
last individual who tried to come in on my business. It took them a month to find him. Am I being clear, Chief A? What's the fuss about? Can you not treat me as a bit of healthy competition? Why are you even talking to him, Duke? I've always maintained two smash knees are worth a thousand words. <laughs> oh, get out! Logic him. There a problem? A problem? There's some kind of problem here, gents. No. Just wanted you to meet my new pals for the bugger the fuck off. Because we're just parting, right? We'll have our reckoning yet, Chive. Soon. What's this? Some flea ridden mutant got you scared, Duke. Just say the word. I'll take care of him. Take a peek at what he's got inside, then make the midget eat it. Sound good? Next time, Earl. Let's go. Right. And don't show your hides run here ever again. Uh, well, that puts me up to the neck in fucking shade without a shovel. Shady, those guys. Who were they? Uh, puffed up fish bladders, Duke. What does he's out to be the new horse son junior, but the bugger's missing a hell of a lot. Specifically coin, influence, men and class. And the other? Errol. A scum jug like few others. Skin of my arse twitches at the sight of him. Back at Mahakam, we'd send so buggers like that down the coal face with a bundle of powder and a leaky lamp. What's this all about? Doing business with them? Exactly the ploughing opposite. You see, Geralt, old pal... About to ask me for help, aren't you? The thing is, I sort of kind of owe a wee sum to a mutual acquaintance. Francis Bedlam, the King of Beggars. To pay off the debt, I've made up my mind to get serious about Gwent. Getting better by the minute. Not the playing of it, mind you, but the cards themselves. The rarest of them fetch princely sums these days. Sadly, that's not exactly arcane knowledge. Got a buyer in heat for my collection, missing just three cards. But Duke's dregs are all over my arse, so... What do you say, Geralt? Fine. We'll try to hunt down those cards. Which ones you need? Fringilla, Vigo, Isengrim and John Natalis. Devilish hard to get hold of. Duke's been trying too, hasn't had any luck. Wait, you don't even know where to look for these cards? Nah, it's not as bad as that. I'm betting Zed's got them. They quit fencing recently, only deals in cards now. Unfortunately, the arsewipe won't talk to me. Not after I bought a one-of-a-kind Scoyatel card out from under his nose. Boy, would you mind going to see him? Zed. Hmm, sounds familiar. Big fish in the card pond. There's a shop along the south wall. And thank you, Geralt. I actually think I stand to pay off this debt now. No problem. See you later, Zoltan. Where are you scurrying to, Rich? Let's see your pass. Pass? What pass? Kind of pass confirms you ain't no mage. Can't enter or leave Novigrad without it. Why have you shut the city gates? So as we can clean it of mages, witches, and other scum that's crawled here since the war began. Aim to catch every last one of them, toss them on a flaming pyre like poxy livestock. Sorry, don't have a pass. You'll scurry no further then. Next! Hang on. How do I get one? Start by making an offering to the church. Then you'll need three pure souls to confirm... Let him through. Here's his papers. What? But we're... Not your concern. Back to your post. Regards from Siggy Ruven.
like Zed's inside, and in hot water. Gotta find another way in. Find it? No. Oh, Duke will be peeved we didn't get Zed to spill where he keeps a ledger. I tried, didn't I? Might have pressed him too hard. Shit. Well, at least we got the ism, Grimcard. Greetings. Oh, fuck. Come on, Ringo. Time to shine. Get him! for something. They were looking for something. Isn't Grim foiled Tiana from the Square Tail deck? I wonder how much this card's worth. Ledger might be worth snooping around for. Either Zed had an ornery cat. There's a hidden compartment under there. Hmm. Must be the names of people Zed sold cards to. Zoltan ought to have a look at this. Beautiful. Zed give you much trouble? Zed's dead. I ran into his murderers. Won't cry over spilt Zed. What about the other cards? Zoltan, sure this business isn't getting a little too dangerous? I mean, men are dying over these cards. Just Zed. Believe you me, he wasn't an innocent bystander. Zed's. I'm certain you snuffed his killers out on the spot, so why worry? Tell me about the other cards instead. Didn't find the other cards. Fuck! Bugger must have sold them. Listen, got Zed's ledger. Show me. Hmm. Entries show him selling the cards to Caesar Bilson in the Ravi. Eh, could have been worse. We need to pay him a visit. Who's Caesar Bilzin? Cleaver's clerk. A decent fella once, but so high and mighty now you can't drink with him, let alone go fishing. Fishing? We met at the Angler's Club, the pride of the Pontar. But Caesar don't show around there no more. So caught up in his new role, he almost never leaves his house. At least we won't have to run around town looking for him. Ravi, who's he? A common card sharp and a swindler. Boggles my mind where he got the coin for the Natalis card. Ever since I gave him a smackin', things between us have been frosty. So you'll have to see him alone. Zoltan, seems awful important to you. 
I'll try to get you those cards. Thanks, Geralt. We can see Caesar together. Meet me outside his townhouse, gaudiest eyesore on Hierarch Square. He had the facade painted gold. And if you want to see Ravi first, I'd look for him at the Golden Sturgeon if I were you. All right. See you later. And no need to pussyfoot around with Ravi. Beat him about the ears a bit. He'll cave. Well, good luck to you, Geralt. the flea-ridden mutant. Join us, please. Ravi loves company. Look how happy he is to see us. You happy, Ravi? Sure he'd be happier if you stopped digging the point of that dagger in his back. Oh, you're just saying that because you don't know the situation. Our mutual friend Ravi here was just about to play for his life and... Uh, Oh, you've got the card. What else do you want? If you'd just given it up, instead of trying to cheat us, we'd be out of your hair already. As it is, that's all your fingers broken. So, it seems the Witcher will have to pay for you. Sound good? Ah! See? Rav is on board. What do you say? We add some spice to the game. Raise the stakes. Ravi's life and the Natalis card. Fancy that? I got no use for Ravi. This witch is no fun. Oh, I'll rip your back off, you <laughs> oh. Left! Left! Yeah! Are here. How'd you make out with Ravi? Got the Natalis card. Excellent! Now we've just Caesar Bilzen to fleece, and we'll be home free. We'll do this. I'll chat him up while you sneak upstairs and search his cabinet of curiosities. He certainly keeps the card there. So what's in this cabinet? Ah, no man knows. You'll be the first to see it. I suspect it's either to do with buggery or metallurgy. But you can tell me once we're done. Let's go! She 
Ivy. She's our Belzen. I remember our quarrel about who's king of the Pontar. The Pike's king of the Pontar. Ah, well, you see, uh, I've come to convince you it's the catfish. And I do not come empty-handed. Who's he? Well, him. Well, that's, that's Geralt. Does say Geralt fish? Yeah. Cast an earthworm the other day. Caught this huge perch. In the pond, You betcha. Can't listen to this hogwash sober. Come in! So what's the dunders or eager biters if they taste like shite and soapy water? That's because you're about as good a cook as a goat's arse as a clarinet. It just recently, I took some fresh thyme. <laughs> and it tasted like thyme flavoured shite. <laughs> Shut it. So, recently, I, I took this thyme. Get out! Care to chime in? How's Xander taste to you? Like shit. All right. Grab your rods. We're off to the Ponta. Can't let this drivel stand. Not in my own home. Well then, did you hear Vibo Matilda last cast a pea and caught a young pike? Suckers lying like always. Ponter Pike aren't so dim-witted to go after his rotten peas. You need life bait. Or night crawlers, though the pike aren't as eager. Don't know why. Once, dug up a crawly so fat and lovely I started drooling. Would have eaten it myself? Uh, that's for sure. Hey, Geralt, what do you and your pals use up at Care Morehead? Live bait. You see, Chibi, he'll make a good angler yet, in some 50, 60 years. <laughs> we'll wait and see. Get out. Go fetch us another bottle. Right. Can see the bottom of this one. So. When are we gonna go noodling for catfish? I'm done fishing with you. You forget what happened last time. What about last time? Shouldn't he have yanked so hard? You wouldn't have fallen in. Attached to the tabletop. Drawers open. Hmm. Triangular hole in the wall. Interesting. Hmm. Fits perfectly. Secret door behind a bookcase. Classic. set from which Emperor Amir ate during his coronation ceremony. The statuette of a man wasn't carved but produced using magic. Shame I can't ask Triss about it. Ah, here's Fringilla. Rope with which Stefan Skellen was hanged. Batier de Rideau's dagger. Joachim de Vet's skull. Hmm, pretty grim curiosity. A set of Aramahid's necklace. Wonder if it's the real thing. Full armor of the 7th Dareland Brigade. Excellent condition. Who 
portrait of Emperor Amir, tempered on wood. Pretty flattering, I'd say. Sultan, time we were on our way. Ah, I suppose so. It's grown late. Wait now. Leaving already? Where's that bottle you went to fetch? Greetings, Belzin. We have a message for you from the boss. Message? What kind of message? Mr. Cleaver's very unhappy. Uh, now, just a minute. If any discrepancies have cropped up in the books, I can explain everything. Too late. Grab him! And you two, get lost! Leave him alone. Cleaver will be extra for killing the Witcher. Well, up to you, lads. Haven't you got all day? Giving me no choice. <laughs> nice razors you got there. Thanks. <laughs> oh, how will I ever explain this to Cleaver? I'd recommend a letter. Right. <laughs> Got a pack. Good luck then. Farewell. Oh. Oh, you've a soft heart after all, Geralt. Oh, by the by, splendid job with that last one. Blood splatter nearly hit the ceiling. Looked through Caesar's cabinet upstairs. And? No wonder he wasn't eager to show it off. Nilfgaardian armor, a portrait of Emir. Joachim de Vett's skull, Vatier de Rideau's dagger, the rope they hanged Skellen with. Oh, oh, oh shit. Disgusting fellow. To think I shook hands with him. Uh, but did you happen to take the rope? I know a few would pay a tidy sum for it. Some go in for that sort of thing. No. Ugh. <sighs> if you say so. Also found a figurine. Nilfgaardian soldier. Magic spell on it of some sort, but I can't tell what kind. Triss ought to know. Good idea. Take it by her house when I get a chance. So, got the full set of cards. What now? Now we collect a shite load of coin for them. Let's go. The exchange. We should do it right quick. Afraid your client might change his mind? Oh, I'm more likely to. Had so many buyers for these cards, I felt like the bell of the ball. So the buyer, who is he? A friend of a friend. Don't know much about him, but he's of juke silk. No doubt about that. <laughs> You know me, Geralt. I'm not prejudiced against anyone. As long as they pay. Oh, move it! Ah, at last. I fear the body's gone cold. What is this? Your would-be buyer handed us his coin and departed. More or less in that order. Now, the cards, please. I trust obtaining them wasn't too troublesome. Try it and find out. <laughs> you wish me to try? I'm not as foolish as Earl. You ought to know that by now. Get to work, boys. The dwarf I wish to have alive. I must have a chat with him. Do it. Geralt, bastards get away with my coin. Damn it, with our coin. Chase the horse, son! I'll tend to the others!
Turn it off that way. Off and not move those out. What? Can't understand a word. Wait, Duke. Might as well stop. Drowners? You could use a Witcher. Ha ha. Highly amusing. If... If I give you the coin, will you leave me be? No. Rather make sure this was our last meeting. You get him? You get the coin? Yes. And what about Duke? Finish him off? Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, that's grand. Well, Geralt, what's your preference? Coin or cards? I never managed without you, so you choose. If you want gold, it's not a problem. I'll find another buyer for these cards in a flash. Rather have the coin. It's yours. I'll still pay the King of Beggars on time. Won't that cocksucker be surprised? Good luck, Sultan. Thanks, Geralt. And remember, the catfish is the King of the Pontar. Sultan. Geralt! I know where Ciri is. Then why are we here? Let's go get the lassie. I'll do that, but I have another job for you. You need to set out for Kaer Morhen. That's where I'll take Ciri. The Wild Hunt will attack soon afterwards. Could use you at our side. You'll have me and my axe. Thanks. See you at Kaer Morhen. Vesemir, Eskel, and Lambert are already there. <laughs> 